My dad's actually an electrician, so I wanted to be a Sparky ever since I was quite young. Well, I love my dad, so I always wanted to be like him. My name is Michael Taonga Ryland, and I am an electrical apprentice at Fonterra Mangaturo. Yeah, I was super interested in coming into Fonterra just for the diversity of things that I'm going to be able to work on and expand my knowledge and my skill set within the trade. Kia ora, my name is Preston. I'm one of the electrical apprentices here at Fonterra. Typically, an uh, electrical apprenticeship is done over four years. You have your theory aspect, and then you have on-job assessing your competency with day-to-day uh, -day tasks. Our workshop's quite big. I think there's 12 odd sparkies here, so loads of experience. You can talk to people, talk through issues. You're not stuck by yourself. If you don't know, someone else will know. A lot of people will talk about growth. You'll find that most people will stay for 10 plus years, so I think it speaks to how good the opportunity is. I'm Chris, I work at Fonterra Clandy Boy as a reliability engineer. Yeah, so I started with Fonterra as an electrical apprentice, and then I was lucky enough to get a full-time role as an electrician at Fonterra as well, and then that has led to my full-time role now as a reliability engineer. Starting with Fonterra as an apprentice really laid a good foundation for all the jobs I've had over the years, and they've also supported me the whole way with other training packages and courses. I say the culture is like real good. Everyone wants to see you do well, especially after your apprenticeship. They want to see you go out and smash it. So yeah, they put a lot into you. We have a really good work-life balance here. Towards the end of last year, my partner and I had our first baby. And so leaving work at work, being able to be at home, be a dad has been something I really value. For people that want to get into the electrical trade, I find it a lot more interesting than the domestic work that I've done. It's a lot more than just red, black and green. When you get into Fonterra, the doors do open up. You may start South Island, could end up in the North Island. You might start in a production team, you might end up in a maintenance team. If you really want to expand your knowledge and expand your skill set, this is the way to go. You work on some pretty cool stuff here.